to former NFL head coach Rex Ryan. Baker Mayfield is, quote, overrated as hell. Ryan said Baker is a one-read guy. He is too slow to outrun defenders. He doesn't get the ball out in rhythm. He is not accurate down the field, and he took too long to get the ball out against the Rams. So, guys, other than that, you know, Rex, he just really likes him as a quarterback. Mm. Uh, some criticism there. Shannon, does Rex Ryan have a point about Baker? He does, Skip. But I think the expectations for coming into the season was too high. You look at Baker, he threw more touchdowns as a rookie than any quarterback in NFL history. And you're talking about some of the greats, the Peyton Manning, yep. Andrew Lux. Yep. Uh, any of the quarterbacks, Baker Mayfield threw more touchdowns as a rookie. Okay, now he's coming into his second season. You trade for OBJ. You pair him with Jarvis Landry, Nick Chubb, and Joku. And you say Baker's going to take that next step. So the expectations are sky high. And a lot of this, Baker invites on himself, Skip. Mm -hmm. You see, when you stare down on the opposing coach yep. and you say, I woke up feeling dangerous, mm. you see, you invite this kind of criticism. You do. You know, I've had to, uh, guys tell me, their coaches would tell them when they're breaking down me when I was playing, Skip, yep. that 84 has a big mouth, but he's a hell of a player. Yeah. Really? You see, when you, when you, if you're okay, you talk it. Mm -hmm. Got no problem, yeah, you're going to talk up. it, but you better back it up now. Okay. I agree. And this is the kind of criticism. This is what Baker has opened himself up to. When you go down the field and you hella running all the way down the field, Skip, mm -hmm. this is what you invite. Yep. And since he's entered the league, Skip, he's thrown the most interception of anybody, even more than Case Keenum, and the, including the three he threw last night. Baker's trumped him. Mm -hmm. Now, we know Jameis is a turnover machine. He's got more INTs than Jameis. Mm -hmm. And you know... Man, Jameis get a ball away like, hey, like you paid him for it. He did Sunday. Again. Hmm. And right now, Skip, it seems to me two things are happening. He's pressing, mm -hmm. and then he's seeing ghosts. Mm. Because there's a lot of times he's running out of the pocket he's when he bolt, doesn't need to. He bolts. And he, doesn't need, and he yep. doesn't need to. No, I agree. So he's, he's invited this criticism mm -hmm. upon himself yep. with his behavior. So if you like that moxie, Hey, oh, take it, hot, you know, take, you know, if you don't like Baker, you don't like Baker, okay, bro. Mm. You, hey, you, do, you, you built this house, because mm. so, we're going to live in it. Mm. So, I'm going to invoke a name on this show that very few people watching this show probably ever heard of. Do you remember Dizzy Dean? I do remember. Okay. I, I All, know the name, I don't remember. But I, Hall of Fame pitcher for the St. Louis Cardinals became a famous TV commentator on baseball games of the week mm -hmm. called the Falstaff Game of the Week when back in the day when there was only one game on TV right. every Saturday. And he was the color commentator, and he was a big, strong, funny guy from Arkansas. And his famous expression was, it ain't bragging if you can do it right. or back it up, Correct. as you just said. And it always stuck in my head from my days as a little kid watching those games. It ain't bragging if you can do yeah. it. Can you do it, Baker? Because he brags a lot. He does. And his whole body language is brag, brag, brag. Right. It's swagger, swagger, swagger. And I love it. I love to watch him. I, I like to watch him play quarterback as much as I like to watch anybody play quarterback in the National Football League, sometimes for better and for worse. Right. Okay. Because he will try things he shouldn't try, and if they connect, he'll go running down the field mm -hmm. celebrating like a wild man. But I, but I need that energy. Okay. You know, I need that energy. I, know. I need the I energy that when he it. wins. Because we, we used to kill Cam when Cam would come in there and sulk, yeah, and agree. he like somebody stole my dog and I he agree. ran over my cat. I you agree. know, Cam was sulking. I, I need that same. Uh, I, th Baker, that's what I Baker. That. You, did you see him Sunday? Uh, you gotta play better. Yeah. No, 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 no. Have that energy you had when you stared down Hugh Jackson. Mm -hmm. When you what the, the game winning touchdown, I need that kind of upbeat. Mm -hmm. I need that kind of positive energy. Yep. Don't come in here sulking. I ain't trying to hear that. <sighs> Same energy you had when you took a shot at Daniel Jones. Yeah, you took, yo, uh, damn. Took, took another shot at Sam Ellinger down in Texas. Yeah. He's playing at a high I, level. I, they have yeah. some history. The, the, yeah. Hold on, that man ain't got no history now. Yeah. What what <laughs> happened to high school or whatever? No, no. That man up there, he in Texas. You were first pick in the draft, and you gonna talk about. I hope he knows I, I don't like him because I know he doesn't like me. Come on, mm -hmm. really? Yep. Normally, we don't see quarterbacks brag openly. Do you don't think Tom Brady think he's supreme talented? But he don't brag because he know guys going to try to peel his... <laughs> they already trying to get him. <laughs> they really going to try to peel your cap. True. They try to, They really want to shut you up. It's a tough league. Man. Yeah. And if you invite them, they will come to your oh, party. They sure will. And they'll walk all over They, they sure will. Yep. They sure, and add a little extra to yeah, it. Uh -huh. They will. So... Again, he started 13 games last year, and he went six and seven. Mm -hmm. 
And as you point out, he threw 27 touchdown passes, and he had a few really big games against Baltimore at home. It, it was really good. 342 he threw in that game, and it was a big upset, and he threw four touchdown passes in another game. He had four or five games where you said, yes. hey, hey, you were not all in on him, and then all of a sudden you crossed over and you mm -hmm. said, you're right, gotcha. But with, with what happens? Okay. Yeah. Odell yeah. happened. Mm-hmm. And Freddie Kitchens happened because Freddie went from calling the plays and being his quiet big brother to, oh, I'm supposed to run the whole football team and call the plays at the same time? And I got to try to figure out how to deal with Odell and Jarvis as they vie for And target. give Nick, Nick Chubb Nick enough Chubb, touches. Chubb, okay, I got it. And Rex Ryan made the point. I want to be an offensive coordinator. Give me Chubb and Odell and Jarvis. I, I, and then Joku and whoever else he said. By the way, and Joku's out right now, so he couldn't play in that right. game. And, and why did he out skip? What uh, happened? Baker threw one of the, one of the medic balls. Medicine ball. <laughs> yep, he threw it, and and Joku tried to catch it, and he paid for it. Yeah, that's not. And a, remember not last a, year, yeah. little Callaway from Florida was just getting loose deep all mm -hmm. the time. He suspended for the first four games, so he didn't have him. And all of a sudden, I'm looking at the targets off the game the other uh, night, and and it's nine targets to Odell and nine to Jarvis. And you don't think this is like running in a calculator in the back of his head? I got to get Odell a couple more balls because Jarvis got two more targets, right? Probably. It's hard, man. Yeah. It, it is hard, and it's too much to think about because last year I don't think he was thinking about much of anything. Yeah, but at some, at some point in time, Skip, you got to sacrifice. Yep. Um, and, and normally, the, the good fam, like, I'm the youngest of three. My brother, I, my older sister and a brother. But there are a lot of times that my sister would sacrifice so me and my brother could have. Yep. Mm -hmm. And there was time my brother would sacrifice so I could have. I don't think this works that way. Yeah, yeah and, and well, you're not going to be successful. <laughs> there are times in the game when no, we were no. at our best in Denver, Ed had to sacrifice, Rod had to sacrifice, I had to sacrifice. Yep. The only person that wasn't sacrificing was TD. Mm. TD was getting his carries. We understood that, Skip, but there were going to be games, I might get 10 targets, Ed and Rod might get three or four between the two of them. But you know what? The next week, it, it was a fluid situation. Mm. It wasn't no, man, I need my, no, no bro, we winning. Mm. And th guess what? As long as there's enough, there's a big, the pie, you know, that, there's going to be enough of the pie. Everybody can eat. Now, you might not get the slice that TD and John Elway got, yep. but you know, I don't need but a little bit. Mm. I, ain't, I don't got no big appetite. I ain't no big eater myself, mm. Skip. You know what I'm saying? Mm. I just want bragging right. That's all mm. I want to do is just talk. You okay. give me a little, I can talk. That's it. So, Baker did a lot of talking through the offseason. He also got, <laughs> he got married, and he did a whole bunch of commercials that are all over my television every time I turn it mm -hmm. on, right? Yeah. yeah. Good for him. <sighs> Good for him, but hard for him. Yeah. Because yeah. now it's a whole new world where it. everybody said, oh, the Browns are going to run away with that division, yeah. and they're a playoff team, and blah, blah, blah. And then Tennessee happened, and now the Rams happened. Yeah. And the Rams are just better than the Browns. We know that. Right. He, he can't, they can't protect Baker. And that's but, what... And, and, and you, don't, you don't hear teams, when teams beat the Patriots, you don't hear teams say, the Patriots are who we thought they were. <laughs> but see, when you start bragging, you start doing all this talking, that's, true. that's what you get. That's a good point. I would agree. <laughs> so we're about to find out exactly what Baker Mayfield is made of mm -hmm. for real. Mm -hmm. And I say he's made of tough stuff and right stuff. And we will see from here. Ba but Baltimore's for real, though, Skip. I know. I got well. That, hey, this is it. Doesn't get much easier. <laughs> Baltimore's no, okay. real. I don't think they're as real as the Rams, but that's just me. You don't think so? Nope. I think the deep. Uh, yeah, I think so. I don't. Especially at home. Oh, they they come get you. Now they're gonna heat him up. Now, Skip. I know they will heat him up. <laughs> you no, know? uh, he. I'm I'm afraid it's gonna get a little worse before it gets better. Oh, a week, the, Martindale. The back half of their schedule the does worst. start to yeah. break up and loosen yeah. up. I mean, I ain't talking about the game show host. Yeah. I know. I'm talking about this, this week, Martindale. Gonna, he gonna send them dogs. Yeah. And then be more a. Hey, that's the one thing Baltimore pride themselves on. They're going to play defense. Mm -hmm. Now, it's not, they're going to always win. I mean, you get a situation like Mahomes, yeah. Mahomes going to lot a lot of people up yep. on defense. Although but. Wink is uh, capable of saying this week that, you know, I think Baker Mayfield is more talented than Patrick Mahomes. That's what he'll say. <laughs> Boy, well, you, so you, just, you just said that Dak Prescott is, so I wasn't I didn't different. I say more talented. I just say he's performing at a higher level. Don't do that, Skip. I just Don't did do it. Don't do it again. Because I backed it up. No, you yes. didn't. No, you it's did. over. No, it's not yep. over. Yep. My homeboy will win the MVP. Okay. Well, he Two should. He should run away with it. No, no, no. no. Why should he? Because he got a coach that gives him the greenest light oh. in the history oh, no. of pro football. You got, Ke you got Kelly Moore who yeah. vibe with him. You know, yeah. that, that got his own guy now. You know, Scott Linehan wasn't his guy. That was Tony Romo's guy. Yep. He got his own guy that vibe with okay. it. Okay. But we do both. We throw it and we run well, it. We do too. With both Zeke and Tony what Pollard. We, what we do is win. Yeah. That's all we do is oh, win. Oh, do you? That's really? all we do is win. Uh, I didn't notice that in the AFC Championship game. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Yeah. Hold up. 
I didn't know. Did the Cowboys get, get, Cow Cow get to the NFC Championship? Yeah. No, they were. They got steamrolled. Go. Yeah, there's nothing worse than getting run over. Mm. I mean, because, I mean, do you know what that means? A man is moving you against your will. Mm -hmm. You trying to sit there. What was the wolf hunter? Mm. The wolf hunter got sick. Mm. CJ I, I had the wolf hunter thrown up on the sideline. Literally sick. Yeah. Yep. Literally. Can't help that. Jayla, Jayla, uh uh. Mm. May Jayla Smith turn it down. Mm. Jayla said, uh uh. I ain't want no more of the bowling mm. ball. The bowling ball with legs, CJ, mm. running through him, Jenny. Mm. All right. Uh, what did they do to Drew Brees years. last year? Do you remember? Who? My guys, what did they do to Drew Brees? Oh, oh, that one game. Yeah, one game. One Thursday. Okay. Well, we gonna see. Watch your old bridge over uh, troubled waters. Okay, well, Teddy Bridge Water. Okay, that means the waters are troubled, right? Yep. For you guys. Yeah. Oh, really? Yep. Okay. You know who sang that song? No, I don't. Simon and Garfunkel. Yeah, it except gonna... it was actually Art Garfunkel who sang a rare solo in that. Yeah. Ooh, just so look you at, know. Look at that I, history I know this skit. Stuff. Yeah. Well, uh. music buff as well, or you just know your facts. I'm impressed. He like this, I know the, 60s music. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> I'm impressed by that. We got to step away from the NFL right now and talk college mm. football because, guys, Michigan, a oh. lot of criticism. And I can't believe I'm saying this, but is it time for them to part ways with Coach Harbaugh? We'll mm. go there next.